So I'm gonna go ahead and do the lady survey. Favorite female YouTubers, Nixie Pixel, because I like everything open source. Mika Kitty, she's got some awesome music. You should go check it out if you haven't. I talk to snakes. I haven't watched her that much, but the videos that I have watched, I've really enjoyed. And I should probably take some time out to watch all of her videos. Okay, female athlete is kind of difficult to me because I don't watch sports. I'm gonna go ahead and pick a fictional game character and say Faith for Mirror's Edge, because free running is awesome. As far as favorite female protagonist in a novel by a female author, I don't read enough books. I'm gonna go ahead and throw out the female author part, unless by some stretch of your imagination you can call John Green a female, and say Paper Towns, because Margot Ross Spiegelman is awesome. So my favorite movies with a female protagonist, directed by a woman, Deep Impact. Now IMDb has this listed as Robert Duvall as the main character, but if you've seen the movie, it's Tay Leon, and it's an awesome movie. Tank Girl is one of my all-time favorite movies. There's also Clueless, Fish Tank, The Kids Are Alright, Red Riding Hood, Things We Lost in the Fire, The Mirror Has Two Faces, An Education, Bridget Jones's Diary, and probably my favorite out of all of these, Eon Flux. I think one of the biggest problems facing female content creators today is stereotypes and the struggle for recognition. And I'm not going to dive any deeper into that because if I did, this would probably be an hour long video. But I will say that I'm very happy to see that it's gotten a lot easier for independent content creators to get their content to a large audience. And I think over time, the problems that female content creators face will be more equal to that of male content creators. If you like this, press the like button down here and maybe you subscribe if you want some more. I'm doing this on the wrong side, aren't I? <laughs>